Hello and welcome to my channel. On February 19, 2024, ConnectWise released a security advisory for its remote monitoring and management software. Vulnerabilities have been discovered in their Screen Connect program and are actively being exploited in the wild. I am Bill Zelensky, a certified information system security professional with 30 years of experience. The first of these two vulnerabilities is CVE-2024-1709 with a base CVSS score of 10, indicating critical. This vulnerability allows an attacker to bypass authentication using an alternate path or channel. This could allow an attacker to directly access confidential information or critical systems. It also allows an attacker to create their own administrative user on the Screen Connect server, giving them full control. The other vulnerability is CVE-2024-1708 with the base CVSS score of 8.4, still considered high priority. This vulnerability is an improper limitation of a path name to a restricted directory. These vulnerabilities have been mitigated in versions 23.9.8 and later. Recommendations. Confirm whether you have an on-premises deployment of Screen Connect server. If you have an on-premises instance in your environment running a version prior to 23.9.8, take it offline immediately until you can upgrade to the newest version. Isolate it or shut it down until it is patched and investigated for signs of exploitation. If you have an on-premises version in your environment that was updated to version 23.9.8 or later, Prior to February 21st, you are not at risk, though it would be prudent to inspect the server to ensure no malicious payloads were installed. If you use the cloud-hosted version, you are not at risk and no further actions are necessary. If your deployment of Screen Connect server is hosted on a third-party vendor, confirm with them that they have upgraded their instance to 23.9.8 or later. If they have not, recommend that they take it offline until the patches are applied. Scan your environment and customer's environment for instances of Screen Connect that you may not be aware of to avoid the risk of those Screen Connect being unpatched and exposing the environment to a supply chain attack. Once patching has been completed, perform a thorough review of the Screen Connect installation looking for unknown accounts and abnormal server activity. Review the users.xml for signs of new accounts or modifications. Inspect your environment for newly added user IDs or accounts and remove or freeze access to them until they are known to be legitimate. And lastly, check the location where any Screen Connect extensions are located for web shells or other payloads, files such as .ps1, .bat, or .cmd. That's all for this presentation. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel. And thank you for watching.